going on five five back again playing more fallout 3 so we're popping out about to pop out in the mall just going to take a quick peek make sure i didn't miss anything over here got the ammo there Let's see well apparently part of that sign just doesn't exist hey i did miss something buff out glad i went back and grabbed that at least that's money worst case scenario that's uh some extra strength to get me to megaton sorry about that i needed a quick drink but now we've made it to the mall oh fucking hell come on fuck you Fuck you. Fuck you. You know what? Why is my weapon not switching? Okay, apparently it just doesn't want to switch weapons. I don't even fucking know. Come on. Wait, plasma rifles up here. Come on. Right in the leg. Or the dick. Whichever I prefer to imagine I shoot him in. Holy shit, this thing shoots quick. Damn. Get crippled, bitch. Yeah, you wanna play these fuck fuck games? I'm coming up there. I'm going to render you into a goo pile. Bum da na 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 na. Why am I humming the hanging tree? I've never even seen the Hunger Games. Or read the books. Will you? Will you? Oh well. Damn. Damn. Harden, your plasma. Not Harden. Harkness, your plasma rifle is saving my ass. Harden, I think, is a paladin in the Brotherhood of Steel. In New Vegas. Oh well, to the bunker! Where we can melt more people. Kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it! Pretty sure he had a minigun. Damn straight he did. Hold you. God, this thing is saving my ass. Why did I pick up his sledge? You know what? Here, game, you can have this back. I don't want this shit. Why would I want a fucking sledgehammer? Never mind, I guess I'll just pick up the sledgehammer and the rad roach meat. Stupid game. Stupid game! You're making me look bad. Ooh, duck and cover. That's not a bad one. Not a bad one at all. Stim pack. Oh, Brotherhood of Steel. Why do I find so many dead initiates in this game? It's depressing as shit. Oh well, put those two shitty ones together. Really? That didn't remove more space? 
All right. Well, dead brother of steel is dead. I think your trap's already deployed, game. This isn't a very good tripwire trap. Oh well, we still got a free minigun out of it for my troubles. And more power armor. I'll wear your bones around my neck! Fuck you. Oh. Fuck you. Get fucked. Squish these together. Come on. Oh, lucky crit melted his ass. Oh, there's another minigun! Take the duck and cover. God damn, where are you coming? Melt, you son of a bitch. Melt into a goo pile like you belong. Run. Fucking hell. To be fair, I am carrying three fucking miniguns. Do I have any frag grenades? I do. Heads up! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fucked. Come on. Die. You cunt. Nailed it. And oh, that was glorious. Is it? Is giblets went into outer space? Yeah, though, this plasma rifle is the only thing keeping me really going. Let's see. Eh, not bad. Not bad quality weapon right there. Let's see. Yeah, I'm just slowly pissing off all the super mutants down here. No big deal, guys. Let's see. I think there's another bunker I can go into for more loot. But I might as well grab Underworld. Ah, oh, hello. You're the friendly ghoul. Hello, Willow. You must be another human with a death wish. Welcome to the mall, tourist. Hmm. Nice to meet you, too. I'm the sentry for Underworld. City of ghouls. Inside the museum. For a tourist, you're pretty clueless. My name's Willow, by the way. Sure did. Underworld. It's right inside the Museum of History, then through the big skull. Most of the residents ain't crazy about humans. But they'll sell to you, fix you up, so long as your caps are good, and you ain't a gotcha. ghoul hater. Those knuckle-draggers? Nah, they don't bother us ghouls. Maybe they see us as kin or something, I don't know. Now there's other assholes. Yeah. yeah, you know, those humans like you. Well, maybe not like you, I don't know, but humans all the same. The Brotherhood of Steel guys with their testosterone and power armor. Those psycho Talon company mercs. Those other I assholes. I get you. 
Come on, here you are in the mall of our nation's fine capital, taking in the sights, visiting the monuments. Face it, you're a tourist. All right. Till next time, sightseer. Well, you're nice enough. And that means we get Underworld. We can get Linkage Rifle now. That might be worth grabbing, actually. Gonna have to fight through an army of ghouls to get to it, but it's gonna be worth it. I might be able to get my gear up to quality shape for once. Underworld Concourse. A weird place to choose for a home, but certainly not a bad one. Oh, well, would you look at that? We got us a smooth skinned visitor. Oh, we we ain't seen one of your type in a long time. Hmm. Smooth skin? You know, because your skin is so smooth and tasty. Relax, I'm just kidding. But I had <laughs> you going, didn't I? You're in Underworld, smooth skin. It's the only safe place for we ghouls in D.C. We're here out of sight and out of mind. The mutants leave us alone, and the slavers usually don't come this far into the city, so it's not bad. Really, the Brotherhood of Steel is the only thing we have to worry about. So long as we don't leave Underworld, right. that is. Bastards. They don't seem to be able to tell us apart from the super mutants. Or maybe they just don't care. They see us and shoot on sight. At least they have the common courtesy to miss most of the time. Still, hmm. bigots. That's right. As long as you don't bother us, we won't bother you. Feel free to come and go, trade, sleep, whatever. Just make sure that you leave whatever trouble is following you at the door. Because we don't want it. So enjoy your stay, right. smooth skin. Enjoy your stay. Just try and keep from shooting up the place. We got a nice little deal going on down here. We'd like to keep it nice. Can you pay me? Then I can repair your stuff. All right. Fair enough. Yes, repair my shady hat. It's getting damaged. I don't have any of the hats to fix it. Hmm. Yeah, fuck. Well. Oh. Naughty night. Oh, she's kebab. That's for sure. Me? I keep every hunk of old rusted pre-war garbage around here in operating condition. We've got lights, water, and ventilation all running off the old crap they used to keep this place going for the tourists. I've managed to keep it going so far, but, well, I'm not sure how long I can keep it up. We've scavenged just about all the scrap metal from all the places we can safely get to. We're scraping the bottom of the barrel here. Hell, not before long I'm gonna have to disassemble poor old Cerberus for parts. Hey, you get around, don't you? Tell you what, you bring me back any scrap metal you find out there, and I'll trade you whatever I can. We can work out a trade. We've got some stuff around here that we don't need, but a smooth skin like you sure, might make what you we got? Well, we got stim packs, but the doc keeps us healed up, so we don't really need them. So I could trade one of those for five bits of scrap metal. We also got us a ton of Radaway and Radex. I mean, what good is it to us? But I'll trade you either one for five bits of scrap. Your choice. All right. Well, all right. That's good to hear, stranger. Just come on back to me when you've gathered some scrap metal. You'll find it just about anywhere. On junked robots, in old buildings, you know. Right. Let me so, know if you have if you'd rather trade scrap metal for just straight up uh, materials, you can trade it with them. How much scrap metal do I have on me? Oh I put it all up, didn't I? Okay. Hello residents. Don't let the smell Tulip. get to you. More. Oh, a human. Well, hello. 
Welcome to Underworld Outfitters. It's it's been so long since I had All a right. customer. Well, we spend it at Carol's or the Ninth Circle, but I don't like it there. The rest we give to Quinn to trade for stuff we need whenever he All goes right. out. Well, yeah, there's a lot of old pamphlets and stuff down here. I've pretty much read it all. all. Right. It used to be part of the Museum of History. The exhibit that used to be here was focused on what happens after death, hell, and whatnot. A lot of it was focused on this old book called Paradise Lost. It's about a guy who goes to hell. Pretty interesting stuff. I found a big box of copies of the book in one of the back rooms. Here, take one. Nobody around well, here thank wants you. them. At first, it was just a couple of people after the war. This was one of the only places that wasn't falling down or on fire after the bombs fell. I think that Carol is actually one of the few that were here then. But over the years, word got around. There had been ghouls living in little pockets all around. Not really so much anymore. Most of them either went feral or ended up here. I'm sure there are still a few out there. But anyone with any sense is in Underworld. All right. Not really. The super mutants leave us alone. I guess whatever they do that turns people like them doesn't work on us. The Brotherhood of Steel will fire on us if we're out in the open, but they don't bother us down here. We've had some raiders and slavers poke their heads in, but we've got Sharon and Cerberus and everyone else to take care of them. I guess when it comes down to it, being this far out of everyone's way is a good deal good for shit. us. Come back any time. It's... If any of the armor fails to protect your life, I'll give you a full <laughs> refund. All right, let's see. You got any amp? You got the railway rifle schematics. That's nice. Ah, you do have a large pile of ammo. I'll take that. I'll take that for damn sure. And hell, if I can work it in, I'll take the railway as well. Let's see, eh. Yep, sell those. Oh, I forgot to put that up. I'll read that later. Psycho. Damn straight, sell all this buff out, Mintat. Don't need this shit. Let's see, uh, what else can I sell? Well, that's some really crappy quality power armor I found. Assault rifle, hunting rifles. Yeah, you can have this laser rifle too. Eh. 10 mil? 10 mil. Not the dart gun, the dart gun's too damn valuable. Minigun might be worth selling. Let's see what else we got. And no, I don't want to sell the darts actually. Flame of fuel, hell yeah. Wait, I got a ton of missiles. Duh. Okay, then let's see. Let's just take the power armor back. See if she's got anything else I'd like to buy. Yeah, five five six will do. A pleasure doing business with you. Come back soon, please. Yes, that's locked, and yes, I can Poor see you it. She's just so lonely down here. Wow, you have a lot of combat gear. That is some really good quality stuff right back here. I think there's also a skill book around here. I just 
want the bottle cap mine. Nailed it. Really? Well, well you know, and I'm not surprised I lost karma for that. I mean, I did just steal her, uh... It's been a while. What have you been up to? You here to buy, or are you just looking around? Oh, yeah, I did buy. I bought a ton of shit. What's going on? I'm keeping it together. You know how it is. It's been a while. What have you been up to? I think this is... Yep, Winthrop's area. He's got himself a nice little area. Problem. I love the name of the medical clinic. The Chop Shop. It's great. What's my medicine at? Uh, forty-nine. Doctor Barrows, at your service. What brings you to that chop shop? Come to lend me a hand. I hope I can always use fresh human samples. <laughs> haven't heard? I'm the foremost authority on ghoul evolution. I want to know what makes us tick. Something doomed us to this rotting form, and I aim to discover what it is. So, I need samples of human skin, organs, and other parts to make the experiments valid. Hmm. Pity. Well then, what can I do for you? Uh, I could use some medical supplies. I think I can. Yeah, right, right away is always nice. Let's see, you got anything else I'd like? Nah, that's about it. You know what? I'll even let you have all the caps. Pleasure doing business with. Bye. Oh. I'm afraid she's going to be out for a while. Don't worry, though. I'm sure the rest of Riley's Rangers will show up soon mm. and take her home. Oh, you must be new around here. They're a mercenary company that bases itself out of the DC ruins. I'm assuming she's their leader, Riley. What was left of her armor had her name stenciled on it. She was in a pretty bad way when they found her outside Underworld. Oh, very well. I'll do what I can. I just hope her body can withstand the strain. Humans are so fragile. There we go. Oh yeah, there's also some named glowing ones back there. What? Where am I? What happened? How long have I been out? Right. Can't remember what I was doing. Wait! Oh, shit! My men! My team! What happened to them? That's not the way I do things. Do you have any idea what it would do to my reputation if word got around that Riley of Riley's Rangers was laid up in a hospital hmm. bed? You're pretty sharp, kid. We packed plenty of firepower, but that didn't help us from getting our asses into serious trouble. I didn't expect to make it out of there alive. I'll help you. We were mapping the Vernon Square part of the downtown ruins and got jumped by a super mutant ambush party. Usually it isn't a problem, but this group was bigger than usual. We fought our way into our Lady of Hope hospital, hoping to find Let cover. me guess, more mutants inside? You got it. More of the ugly bastards just kept coming. We fought our way to the roof and found a way across to the Statesman Hotel next door. The super mutants seemed driven, like they smelled blood. They kept following us. Once in the hotel, the only way bad to go move. was up. Very bad move, but we had no choice. On the way, we lost Theo, one of my guys. We were unable to get the ammo case off of his body as we were pushed onwards. So... Guns almost dry. We hit the roof of the statesman. Hmm. Actually, we did lay down a bunch of countermeasures. I don't know how many of them have already gone off, though. When I slipped out with my stealth boy, I think I almost tripped one or two of them. Damn near didn't make it out of there at all, come to think of it. All right. Get the rangers home. 
please. That's all I want. I don't care right, how I'll you do, do it. Alright, I'll do it. Whew. I was holding my breath on that one, I think. I wasn't sure what you were going to say. All I ask is that you hurry. I don't know how much longer they will be able to survive up there. I also recommend you try and find the body of Theo, one of my men. He was carrying our main ammo supply. Here, let me punch the ammo box code in some better directions than All your right. Pip-Boy there. We have a headquarters not far from here. If you can make it there, you're welcome to anything you need inside. Just punch in Riley0247 at the gate. We have ammo, supplies, Thank you. you name it. If I wasn't asking for your help, I'd tell you to stay away. It's thick with super mutants. I don't know why. Butcher, our team medic, has always suspected something's in the area they are looking for or being attracted to. The only place worse I can think of mm. is the mall. Your best bet is to stay with the metro tunnels. Head north from here to Metro Central. Then look for the tunnels to the DuPont Circle Station. Exit from the DuPont Circle Station into what we call the Dry Sewers, and eventually you'll wind up in Our Lady of Hope Hospital. All right. Not much, I'm afraid. Oh, wait. The hospital may have some supplies that will help you. We saw some storerooms on the way to the roof, but didn't have time to All raid right. them. We were mapping the Vernon Square part of the downtown ruins and got jumped by a super mutant ambush party. Usually it isn't a problem, but this group was bigger than usual. We fought eventually. I left my guys up there and tried to stealth out, but got caught by a muty ambush patrol. That was the last thing I All remember. Right. There's five of us. Oh, wait. Four now. I almost forgot about Theo. Poor bastard. Besides myself, of course, we have Brick, our heavy weapon specialist, Butcher, our medic, and Donovan, our tech. All of them have been with me for years. I trust any of them uh. with my life. We lost him on one of the stairwells on the second floor of the Statesman Hotel. He almost made it, but one of the muties hit us with a frag grenade. Blew him apart. If you can get to his ammo crate, there's a ton of rounds inside. Bring as many as you can Good to the shit. Rangers. Before I left, I gave them an order to keep broadcasting for help over their radio. Hopefully, when you get near their location, Good you'll shit. pick it up. Careful out All right, there. Alright, so that's what we'll be doing. Uh, probably not next part, but once we take care of the... You know. The shit in here, we'll do that. Oh, wait, I forgot to go talk to the other, uh, NPCs. She. Oh, this one's my favorite. Scanning. Attention. Civilian on deck. <laughs> this is a town full of peace-loving ghouls, so check your bigotry at the door. They're just like humans. They feel, they hurt, they bleed. They deserve the same love and respect as any human, and don't you forget it. At least that's what they programmed me to say. Personally, I think they're a bunch of rotting zombie maggot farms, and I'd send them all back to hell if I could. Damn this combat inhibitor! This is actually fun. Uh, if you have a high enough science, you can disable his combat inhibitor and let him go nuts on Underworld. Negatory. I have been programmed to remain on premises at all times. In the event of hostilities, I will respond with deadly force. Go, Underworld! Go, ghouls! Yeah! Damn this pansy zombie. Alright, this has been Core 955 playing Fallout 3. Thank you for joining me, and goodbye.